Jerome. Jerome at eight in the morning, among the thick autumn fog. The silence was broken by the mooing of the cows, smell of fresh milk in the air, morning dressed in mystery, between the sweat of the lakes, home of green toads and loons, embedded in a chess table. This is Idaho. Drops of sweat from invisible rivers, home of the bass and immortal bats. I'm on my way to Jerome High School, with my backpack loaded with scholarships for farmers, slinging like a brig in the nebula, wet leaves of time. I embed myself in the dense cloud, like ocean that catches me in the open. The thick fog covers my attitude. It is the year of 2020, and I feel like a lamb from the slaughterhouse. I had to deliver my cargo of promises, of precious gems. The children were waiting for me anxiously. I turned on the radio in my car, and the news about the death toll, it increased second by second, minute by minute. It doesn't matter anyway. In Jerome's fog, I'm just a ghost. I come from the South, and death does not scare me. I am at peace with my soul and with my God. I still have the rosary that my mother gave me, and the image of the Virgin of Miracles of Kakuap guides my destiny. In the news, the dead keep adding up. But in my hands, I had life, polished gold, the college assistance migrant program.